the way they zigzag is <laughs> frustrating. Yeah. Just stand perfect broadside still in the middle of the field at exactly 150 meters, and we're good. You know? Uh-oh. <gasps> oh! Whoa! Two-tone, baby! Two-tone! I thought piebald. I thought it was a piebald. Let's, let's see how close we can get to this dude and take a picture. Look at that beauty right there. Take pics with camera. Good point. Photograph a moose. Well, I didn't know that was a... You know what I don't have on me? I don't think I have... I don't think I have my uh, moose collar on me. They gone. Hate to see you go, but I love to watch you leave. I can't even fit it all on the screen right now. <gasps> oh God. He's attacking us. He's aggressive. <laughs> This is awesome. We're getting attacked by the great one moose. Oh God. Nope, I said we're getting attacked by the great one moose. Photograph a black grouse. So, so somewhere in there, there was a black grouse. Bob and weave, baby, Bob and weave. Come on, you can't hit me. you think? Mm. Mm. There he goes. Oh. Take them photos. You need that thumbnail. <laughs> I know, dude. I know. Jeez. That was fun. I, I That was a bonus. I didn't think... I didn't think he's going to go aggressive, but dang. Yeah, polymer tip, save it. All right, now we're there. Ammo. Tip, save it. All right, we are there. And so when we pull this bad boy up, we can zero for... We're going to try taking him for 75, though. So that's our go, 75. And we're going to spray. So I wonder if that has to do with some of the plaques. If you have the option now to do a European mount. Because I think that's cool if that's, if that's the case. I just want to keep him lit up. I want to make sure he's calm the whole time. We're going to get 75 meters. Get up close and personal with this guy. 
make sure we get some good penetration. And you know what? I got that chestnut too. So I've been very fortunate. Now, the luck part for me, in my opinion, you create your own luck with these great ones by following your methods and what you do and grinding. And basically, getting a great one is just being stubborn enough to not quit. That That is what getting a great one is. It's just being stubborn enough to refuse to quit. That's, that's what getting a great one is. The luck part is this right here. The actual fur type that you get is the luck part. And I've been extremely lucky. Extremely lucky. I blessed when i saw it like i was telling them early if you just ma made it in when i first spotted him i got excited because i thought he was a piebald but then i i you could tell in the same sentence my excitement level reached another notch once i realized he was fabled so there was two different types of excitement there alexi welcome in Good to have you here. How far am I away from this? 85 meters. I'm trying to head toward this high ground here. I got 10 meters from me today, so surely I can get 75 meters and not be noticed. All right. We should be getting close to being able to see this dude now. What bullet and what one? The new muzzle loader. The polymer tip sabot. And we as soon as I got a good shot here, it's it's right at six o'clock, so I say we we get this guy as soon as we can. We got a great wind. We look at that sight right there. Isn't that a beautiful sight? Just how would you freak out if you saw that in real life? You were just wouldn't you freak out? If something, if you saw antlers like that, just stick up like that. I would freak them out. Trying to give you all a good view of him. He's calm. I could put him down right there. I want you all to have a good view of him. What do you think right there? Should I shoot him? I feel like I can, I don't have anything blocking me right there. I think that's a good, I think we should put him down right there. I don't even have to zoom in. Ugh. His health is dropping. It just don't drop fast enough with this muzzleloader. Die, die, die. There he goes. There we go. He had a good life. He was eating. He was eating something good, wasn't he? Oh my God, I froze there for a second. I froze for a second. I'm scared. I got to get over here. Wouldn't you like to have the agility of this guy? He is sprinting and loading a muzzle loader at the same time. And for those of you real life hunters out there, you know what I'm talking about. That is impossible. <laughs> I would love to have the strength to do that. Like I have to like put every bit of my weight into it. When I'm loading my muzzle loader, I get up on the step and everything. And Oh, look at that. Look at that. You know what? That's a picture. That's nice. I'm nervous. Let's get him taxidermized. Hold on. Okay. Taxidermized. Then we'll celebrate. Okay, he's taxidermized now, which I meant to save him. Oh, well, uh, instead of taxidermizing. Now we got to get a good thumbnail. Now, how is it you zoom in? Don't forget to save file after you. Are, hey, I have to do that anyway. I have to save my, I have to, once I figure it out. Look here, this is the screenshot of the year award goes to Darth. Right there you go. There you go. Hey, like my great one, guys. Oh my God. With this one, you got to get the side a little bit. You know what I mean? Because I love the way that, that, that fades back that fur right there. 
Thank you so much, guys, for the congrats. Mike's reminded me to breathe. Look at that. Got right there. It's just a look at just would you just look at it? Would you just look at it? He's got his water pouch right there, his, his reserve pouch. You know, he's going to drink a little bit now, let a little bit hang down there, save that for later. Oh, look at that beauty right there. 